A day after Democratic presidential candidate Hillary Clinton called on Mylan to drop the price of its EpiPen, the company says it is slashing the patient cost of the drug through a savings card. The card covers up to $300 of EpiPen 2-packs, which is about half of its current price. EpiPens are preloaded injections of adrenaline that people use if they're having a severe allergic reaction that could be deadly if untreated. Mylan bought EpiPen in 2007. Since then, the drug's price has zoomed from $100 to $600. Peter Pitts is a former FDA official. He now runs the Center for Medicine in the Public Interest. Well, the larger picture here is what drives prices down is competition and there's no competitor for EpiPen on the market right now, and it's off patent. So what the FDA really needs to do is to prioritize the review of generic drugs for products that don't currently have a generic on the market. As soon as the FDA approves a generic for EpiPen, the price is going to plummet 70 or 80 percent. A group of lawmakers said on Wednesday that they had written to the U.S. Food and Drug Administration to ask about its approval process for alternatives to the EpiPen. Mylan stock, which had fallen more than 10% this week through Wednesday's close, regained some ground on the news.